open AI can't stop. They are on a rampage. I mean, I love this company. I really do. I love companies that push the boundaries. They continue moving forward. They continue innovating and open AI does that. And like I said, I love chat GPT. That's my number one. But Google Gemini is on their heels because I like that one, too. I've been using them a lot lately. I'm going to tell you right now. So anyway, this article is titled Open AI Unveils Chat GPT Enhanced User and Interaction Memory. Listen, we have some more uh, videos coming where I'm going to show you some um, AI, some more AI for business. I'm just putting that together. But let's get through this right here because this is good information as well. Open AI is testing an option to allow ChatGPT to remember details from users' previous conversations. Users can ask the generative artificial intelligence chatbot to retain specific information from one exchange to the next. Bloomberg said on Tuesday, February 13th, citing a blog post from OpenAI ChatGPT will also be able to automatically determine what information from a user's conversation should be remembered, Bloomberg added. OpenAI will initially make the features available to hundreds of thousands of free, take advantage of it while it's free, of free and paid ChatGPT users. The company plans to review feedback before offering it on a wider scale. The company told Bloomberg, OpenAI will notify users if they gain access to the feature, the company said per the report. Those with the feature will be able to delete individual details that were saved, clear all of it all at once, or choose to turn off the option. Users can also ask ChatGPT what it remembers to get an idea of the information it has retained. That's wild. What do you remember that I said? <laughs> That's like being in a bad relationship, right? <laughs> what do you remember? What did I just say, right? Anyway, <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> OpenAI, oh, um, the new feature is OpenAI's latest attempt to make ChatGPT more useful and personalized amid an increasingly crowded chatbot market. Bloomberg said, despite a growing number of rivals, OpenAI is the leading is leading the market, reportedly surpassing $2 billion in annualized revenue in December, according to Payments Report last week. Well, well, yeah, well, like I, just from my experience, they're the best of the best still. Right now, they're still the best of the best. ChatGPT is still the best. Um, but others are getting closer, right? So additionally, the company believes it can more than double this number next year, citing strong interest from business customers who want to use its generative AI tools in the workplace, according to a Financial Times report. Once again, see what, see what I'm talking about? They're bringing AI more and more to the workplace, to the businesses. This is what I was saying. Small businesses better jump on this, these free AI opportunities while they can before those big businesses jump in and take all that money. Right now, it's anybody's game. And uh, you can do everything with small, with AI for small businesses. You can have you can hold interviews with, with AI so you don't have to waste your time. AI goes through all of the different um, applicants, chooses the best ones. It even gives them tests like uh, specialized tests for whatever industry you're in. It can do that. You can have AI doing your finances and stuff like that. You just buy find secure AI. They have free free programs that you can play with. Right. It, they have AI for everything. I don't think the window is going to be that that big for how long these things are going to be free or, you know, cheap. If you want to be real, once those big industries start getting in, the prices start, start skyrocketing because there's more there's more uh, uh, there's more demand. So CEO Sam Altman is reportedly pitching a multi trillion dollar project to investors, including the government of the UAE, United Arab Emirates, to raise funds for an initiative that would increase the planet's chip building capabilities and AI capabilities payments reported on Sunday.